Hello and welcome to the Computer Lab Vids YouTube channel. And in this video, I am going to show you how to increase your mouse pointer size in Windows 10 to make it easier to see. So the first thing we need to do is open the control panel. You can access the menu direct, but we will go into uh, the ways just to get into control panel because Microsoft have removed it from the start menu. So click on File Explorer on the bottom uh, of your taskbar. Click on where it says this PC. Go up to the top icon next to this PC, the little arrow. You click on that, left click on that, go down and click on control panel. Once you're in the control panel, obviously we can adjust things, but we'll just close that for now, just show you another way to open the control panel. Go down into the bottom search box, uh, type in control panel, you can see straight away it's starting to appear in the best match. Click on control panel and that opens the control panel up in Windows 10. Uh, and gives us some options so we can get to the mouse uh, pointer size within here. Okay, so now we're in this menu. Uh, there is, like I say, a couple of ways to get into the uh, mouse uh, settings, but we'll go down into um, our menu within here. Click on hardware and sound. Uh, right at the top uh, menu where it says devices and printers, you will see there there's um, a mouse um, word. And we just click on the mouse word there and then it opens up the mouse property box. So I'll just close the control panel down so you can see what we're doing. Uh, multiple tabs along the top, yours might be selecting a different one, but we want the one that says pointers. Click on pointers, and then once you're in here, you can now select the type of pointer you want. So the scheme currently is set to none. That's the default one within Windows 10 for this mouse settings. Um, you can pick and choose whichever one you want in here, whichever makes it easier for you to see. So I've picked the Windows Black Large, um, and then you, again, you can see the different um, icons and mouse pointers. So I'll pick that one up and just see there and it, see what it looks like. Doesn't look that much different really, but pick another one. Gone a bit larger, that looks probably a bit easier to see. And you can see there it matches as soon as you click apply at the bottom. It picks that particular scheme up. Um, again, like I say, you can flick through the different mouse options, finding one that your uh, preferred choice is. I'm just going to select none, click apply, because uh, I, I just want to show you the other way to get in. So I'll select uh, none there, click apply, and then click OK to close out. So going down to the uh, Windows key in the bottom left again, click on the settings icon, which is the one that looks like a cog. And then this is the thing that uh, Microsoft is sort of pointing us towards from the control panel, but click on where it says devices. You can do a search for it if you want, but I'll just show you how to get in there through the menus. Click on devices. Uh, you see all your devices that are installed. This is on this particular computer. And on the left there, we want to click on mouse and then additional mouse options where just underneath where it says related settings, click on the additional mouse options. And this will open the same box that we've just been looking at before, the mouse properties to increase our mouse pointer size. So again, pick the correct tab along the top. There is multiple different ones. Click on pointers and then you can select whichever mouse pointer you want within your Windows 10 environment. So it's as easy as that. Pick up a scheme you want, pick the mouse size and apply it to your scheme. Obviously, once you pick the mouse uh, size up, make sure that you click apply and then click OK. Otherwise, um, Windows uh, 10 won't remember the mouse uh, pointer options or uh, the scheme that you have picked. OK, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, please do give us a like. Any comments below, um, please do subscribe to my channel. It all helps to keep my channel going. Thank you very much for watching.